Lockheed Martin's production facility in Fort Worth, Texas, has started manufacturing the first F-35A Lightning II fifth-generation multi-role stealth fighter for the UK-based the 48th Fighter Wing at Royal Air Force Lakenheath. The United States Air Force has announced. A public vote helped pick the new nickname for the 495th Fighter Squadron, which will be based at Royal Air Force Lakenheath. It will be the first for a new unit under the 48th Fighter Wing, a fighter squadron flying the latest supersonic jets out of a Suffolk airbase will be known as the Valkyries. In Norse mythology, Valkyries were female figures who chose who died and lived in battle. An image released by the United States Air Force on April 30 showed the forward fuselage section of the aircraft, ready to begin the assembly process on the production line. The aircraft is scheduled to be delivered to the 48th Fighter Wing at Royal Air Force F. Lakenheath later this year, highlighting the fast pace of production at the facility. They will fly F-35A fighter planes, the first overseas United States Air Force squadron to do so, when the jets arrive in the United Kingdom later this year. The 495th Fighter Wing will be the first United States-operated Lightning II unit to be based in Europe. Equipped with 24 aircraft, it will be joined at a later date by a second, yet to be formed F-35A squadron. This unit will also operate two dozen aircraft and will fall under the umbrella of the 48th Fighter Wing at Lakenheath. Lieutenant Colonel Ian McLaughlin, the incoming commander of 495 Squadron, said, Valkyries epitomizes the forces move toward more inclusivity and equally represents the fifth-generation stealth fighter's air superiority. I am honored to be the first commander of the initial U.S. Air Force overseas-based F-35A unit. Like the Valkyries themselves, we'll be vital to determining the fate of our adversaries in the battle space. The 48th Fighter Wing has been based at Royal Air Force Lakenheath since 1960, and currently operates F-15 fighter planes. The amount of support we received, and continue to receive, from the community both here and back home has been overwhelming and highly appreciated, 48th Fighter Wing Commander Colonel Jason Camaletti said in the release. Basing F-35s at Royal Air Force Lakenheath will be a game-changer as it will allow us to further advance interoperability with our European teammates, and is a visible demonstration that we and all of NATO will continue to own the skies. While Lakenheath's 495th Fighter Squadron will be the Air Force's first overseas-based F-35s, Aleson Air Force Base, Alaska, is the first United States Air Force base outside the continental US to receive the jets.